space and astronomy. We all look up at the sky every now and then, perhaps to observe the weather or to watch an aeroplane fly by. The vast open space that holds our world and everything in it is called the universe or space. Even today, man knows little about how the universe came into being. However, with the help of science, much has been written about outer space, its origin and its evolution. The universe is like a giant sized canvas and the life that exists in it is like a painting. From the tiniest particles to the biggest celestial bodies, the universe contains everything. The sun, the moons, the stars, planets like earth, billions of galaxies and much more together make the universe. The empty black space we often see in between the stars at night is also a part of it. In fact, no one knows just how big space really is. The Big Bang is the most widely accepted theory about the beginning of the universe. The scientific study of space has given rise to many theories to explain its existence. Most astronomers believe that over 15 billion years ago, the universe was created after an enormous explosion. This is known as the Big Bang. No one knows what caused the Big Bang, but this explosion set space into motion. At first, the universe was a tiny ball of hot gas, which gradually cooled and grew bigger. Over the time, the cooling gases caused space to expand and form the sun, several galaxies, planets, stars and many moons. The spectroscope was one of the first tools used in the study of space. This instrument helped us learn that the universe is continuously expanding. The universe is one big family that includes millions of different objects. Besides galaxies, the planets, the sun, the moons and the stars, space is made up of several fragments of rocks, gases, dust and ice particles. These elements float around in our solar system and form a large part of the universe. The Solar System The solar system is made up of the Sun, the nine planets and their 172 known moons, asteroids, comets, dust and gas. The planets, asteroids and comets travel around the Sun, the center of our solar system. Most of the bodies in the solar system travel around the Sun along nearly circular paths or orbits in the anti-clockwise direction. Solar system formation began billions of years ago when gases and dust began to come together to form the Sun, planets and other bodies of the solar system. Moons in our solar system As of October 2008, there are 172 known natural moons orbiting planets in our solar system. 166 moons orbit the full-size planets, while 6 moons orbit the smaller dwarf planets. 